Hi Stan, it's Clayton from Armstrong Dodge. Thank you for expressing interest in our uh, 2019 Grand Cherokee Limited. I thought I would do you a quick walk around video on the vehicle to help you get a better idea of it from a distance. This Grand Cherokee Limited is in a beautiful white, bright white color. Looks really good on the Grand Cherokee, especially with the chrome package added to it. Have nice bright projector headlights, fog lights. Good looking rims on this one. Chrome mirrors, chrome accents around the windows, cargo rack. Of course the limited badge. Let everyone know you're driving a limited. Beautiful. Automatic tailgate. And a nice large cog cargo area. Some power outlets back here, some hooks for hanging things up, lots of space, it's a cover. In case you want to separate. So this vehicle has the proximity sensor for the keys, so you can keep the key in your pocket. Just walk up to the vehicle and it will unlock for you. Really nice large back seat area. Very comfortable. Beautiful leather interior on this vehicle. The light tan. They have their own heat vents back here, power center. Everything you need to keep them happy and comfortable. Really nice uh, kind of charcoal colored wood grain accents with some chrome on the interior of this vehicle. Power windows, power door locks, mirror adjusts. You have uh, the ability to save seat settings. So once you have it where you like it, you can save it there. Push button start, keys in my pocket still. Really large information display there between the gauges. It's controlled with your uh, steering wheel controls here. You can change the information that's displayed. And with some of them you can even change the style that the information is displayed as. This has a large Uconnect screen in it. Sirius XM. Uh, FM and AM as well, available. Your media center. So any kind of music player or a phone, once it's hooked up, you'll be able to play music off of it there in that tab. Your climate controls. This vehicle has heated seats and heated steering wheel installed, so that's always nice. You also have tactile climate controls down here, so while you're driving down the road you don't need to uh, go into the screen to make those adjustments, so you can do them quickly down here. There's just further adjustments you can do up on the screen. App drawer, kind of like a phone. Anything you find yourself using a lot here, you can pull down to the bottom so it's easily accessed. You have your off-road pages on this vehicle as it is a Jeep. And it gives you information about the angle uh, of the vehicle where it's sitting, what your drivetrain's doing, all that good stuff. There's an auto stop start feature on this vehicle. It shuts off at stoplights or other times when you stop the vehicle for just a short while. And it does save fuel. If you want to turn it off, you can turn it off right there. This vehicle has uh, your sensors, your proximity sensors around it for parking. You can turn those off here. Eco mode off. So eco mode saves fuel. Sport mode on. It makes the vehicle react more aggressively and it uh, really does make the vehicle feel quite sporty for, for a larger SUV. 
and tr your traction control off button. Here's where you'll find uh, your different settings for the uh, select train system. So auto will automatically choose how you how the vehicle reacts to to certain uh, things that you're, you're traveling through. And then of course there's snow, sand, rock, and mud. So depending on what you're you're trying to get through, you can change your options there. Four wheel drive low. It also has the descent control. If you're going down in a steep grade, you can set your speed and the vehicle will hold itself back for you without without you working the brake. Uh, nice sunroof in this one. Once again, these beautiful light brown, light tan seats. So there you go. I'll try and keep it fairly short. I hope you enjoyed the, vi the video and uh, look forward to meeting you in person. Thank you. Once again, it's Clayton from Armstrong Dodge. Have a good day.